Um, hello YouTubers. Um, I'm showing you how to clean your traps and the bait I used to catch a raccoon. So, first I will show you how to clean your traps. I just cleaned this one here. I have more traps than where this came from. But you just want to, uh, might just want to get you like a fish kebab stick or something. Let's clean the inside of them. Uh, if you let them get too dirty, uh, if you let them get too dirty, they'll get rusted. Then you have the ball and stuff. So that's how you do that. I have like two, three more of these type traps, and I have kind of bad trap right outside the door. I am inside, so if you hear the television, sorry. You can use a toothbrush for this also. This is a little toothbrush, uh, WD-40. Keep your traps oiled up. Shovel to make your dirt dirt hole set or whatever. Uh, a hammer to draw your stick on ground if that's what you want to do in the bait. This is um, bacon grease, dog food, and peanut butter. This is about the best bait I have. I'll show you how it look. So, uh, give me a second. And your bait is right there. Um, it, um, you can see how it's greasy. That's the bacon grease. It's peanut butter in there mixed with it. Got a little corn. You probably see some right over there. A little yellow piece of corn. I used to have bird seeds in there that just need to clean it up. Stuff, but never had time. So I'm going to screw this back on. And I'll show you the rest of the stuff. If you have this, most likely you catch a coon every time. Okay. Um. Something else. If you uh. If you set this here. If you set this here beside a creek, you will catch a coon. If you set it on dry land, not around a creek, you will catch a possum. Most likely every time. It is very rare to catch a uh, coon. Uh, if it's not around the creek, but it's possible. I I caught one like that before. I was surprised. So. Coons tend to hang 200 yards from the, uh, each other, uh, especially male coons. So ain't nothing but uh, fish oil. I got some fish oil. Put it in a uh, squirt bottle, a uh, ketchup bottle. Just have a little stuff around the house to use. Uh, this is, I know this is like a Kool Aid can. I found it kind of interesting to use it. Uh, peanut butter, you can use this by itself and catch a raccoon. Squirrel, if you want to survive. This is all you need peanut butter. If you have peanut butter, this is all you need to survive because you can have squir squirrels come into it. You might get a couple rabbit, deer, I don't deer for sure. Coon. Possum, all that type of stuff. So, uh, last thing I want to do here is show you guys this. Only thing this here is, it's um, this is syrup and dog food. Let it get that loud smell out there. Um, it's very good. Stuff like that. So, right, I'll wake you up with I have one, two, three, four. I have four different types of bait. Uh, one, two, three. My name is Antonio. If you like the video, subscribe. 
And uh, if you have any questions, just make a comment. And see you folks later. Bye.